we're going to create a conditional format for our values here that says highlight the top X percent of values and we're going to control that conditional format with some slices. So as we choose the percentage on the slices, then the conditional format will get changed as well. Now let's create a pivot table. Let's highlight the percentage list that we created here. Go to insert and pivot table, an existing location, and we can just put it there for now. Now what we're going to do is throw in the percentage into our row labels. Now, grand total, we can get rid of that. And what we're going to do is reference this first cell here to our conditional formatting rule. Now, what we're going to do is insert some slices, go to insert and percentage slices. And then we can just, and we can add some more columns. And we can just put it there, change the color. So let's click in our pivot table here and go to conditional formatting, new rule. And let's choose all cells showing sum of sales value. And then format all cells based on their values. And let's choose a three color scale. The lowest value will have a 0%. The midpoint will be a 50 percentile. And the maximum will be a percentage and we're going to reference this to the first cell here and press enter. Now the color we're going to change to green and red and press OK. So now as we press 50, our cell reference is here. So it'll show the 50% on our maximum value and then we will go 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, and then 95. So what it's showing here is the top 95% values, as you can see here. So the top two or three values there are highlighted in red. The midpoint is in yellow and the low point is in green. So you can do some pretty funky stuff with slices and conditional formatting just by referencing the selection chosen by the slicer back to your conditional formatting rules.